the office segments have been blasted as waffle and time wasting by furious viewers left hot under the collar after the second show of the 2018 series. Sunday Tea Time's Dancing on Ice spanned two hours with just six couples showing off their routines before the eviction skate off. After each contestant performed, the camera crew would pan backstage to capture celebrities, rehearsing or hosts Holy Willoughby and Philip Schofield giving a much needed pep talk. The most recent episode even saw Judge Ashley Banjo scoot away from his desk and to the training rink to grill Love Island's Kem C. Cheney and his fellow competitors about the group routine. Yet despite the ITV talent show's successful comeback fans seem to tire of the lack of actual dancing on the ice. One took to Twitter to rage, stop the time-wasting backstage waffle. The whole production is awful. Another put, get rid of the backstage stuff, adds nothing to the show, would be better as a separate sideshow. A third commented, don't like this backstage malarkey. It's too noisy. Meanwhile one Irk Telefan put, what's with hashtag dancing on us trying to be hashtag SCD. It wastes time chatting with contestants backstage. FFS. Sunday's episode saw its first live eviction and bake-off winner Candice Brown sent home, and the result wasn't without controversy either. The cake queen and skating partner Matt Evers faced Lamar Obeco and Melody Lamwell in the dancing on ice skate-off, but viewers were completely baffled when, after the judges' scores were tied at two each, it was announced that Candice would be sent home, despite the apparent tie-break. Lamar himself appeared confused over the news, but he wasn't the only one as fans raced to Twitter to vent their frustrations. Philip did announce before the skate-off that while all judges would vote, in the result of a tie it would fall down to head judge Christopher Dean, but even fans who were aware of the system were left seething. It seems viewers missed Philip revealing the rules, leaving them stunned when Candice was suddenly announced to be going home.